In the video today, we will be talking about freedom. So, um, as I said in my previous video, uh, I will be recording a lot of new videos now. And one of the things that I really wanted to do is to define words and not specifically define words as in a dictionary but more as in how people feel about certain words and just what it means to them really and i decided to start uh, this series of videos with the word freedom because i believe this is such an important word very powerful and it just means something different for each person and it's really beautiful uh, the idea of what it is to be free so I talked to some of my friends and collected uh, the uh, collected their definitions of the word freedom. Uh, we'll read uh, some of them and also I will talk a little about it and I hope you like it. So uh, the first word, uh, the first word, the first person is um, a very old friend of mine called Vitor. He's from Brazil. And he defines freedom as in, it means that my life makes sense. It is to be the owner of my choices and to know the consequences of them. It means to have options of paths to take. So this is the first definition that I have of freedom. I will move to the next one. Um, this one is from a friend of mine from Argentina, he's called Charlie, and he said, freedom is the most valuable right a human being can possess. Given the right circumstances, it lets us be what we really are. Um, another definition that I have here um, comes from an American friend of mine called Kelly. And I particularly like this one. He says, freedom is the ability for self-autonomy and to make decisions. Or having the ability to exercise your own will. So this one is a little more... Um, is a little more um, connected to the actual definition of the word. Um, detached from how you feel it. Uh, but I found it a very interesting way to put it. And the last two definitions I have are by two other American friends of mine. One of them is Yesenia. She says, freedom to me is a birthright. It is the right to self-determination. It is an open invitation to express every single part of of you without restriction and last but not least important here from my american friends is freedom to me is the ability to act how i want love who i want be who i want worship how i want without interference from anyone so this is from my friend kyle and Oh, actually, I have just one last one, and this one is from a friend of mine from uh, Russia called Zimon, and he says, for me, uh, this one is very long, but uh, he says, for me, freedom is not about waving LGBT flags in a country such as Russia, you know, where he's from, but it is about being aware of what the other day is going to be like. It is about not being judged or receiving weird looks when people get to know where you are from. Freedom for me 
is totally a mental thing. I don't want to encounter any prejudice. Being free is when you're able to think differently and not be judged by that. So, what I found from this is that each person feels what it is to be free in different ways because I believe each person has had different restrictions uh, in their lives, something holding them back. Um, therefore, freedom becomes the opposite. It becomes a neglection of something that held us back, you know, that um, that kept us from expressing ourselves. And what I really liked about it is that as I was talking to these people, I also started wondering what freedom means to me. And I remembered an interview from Nina Simone, uh, a singer and pianist, a brilliant pianist actually. Um, and she says in an interview that for her, freedom uh, means no fear. So when you have no fear, you are free. And I just loved this definition so much. And I think I, um, I borrowed it for myself because I really believe in that. So when you no longer have fear, it is when you're actually free to be who you are and to express your thoughts and express yourself as a human being. So yeah, um, now it's your turn. So why don't you drop your definition of freedom in the comments below. If you like the video, please just give it a thumbs up. I would really appreciate it and I will leave the definition of some words that I spoke in this video um, so that you have uh, some material to look at and some different nice words um, of which you can read the definitions so yeah uh, Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.